Hello, this is Broyer, and welcome back to another episode of our Let's Play for Against the Storm. As we continue our run here on a little bit harder difficulty than usual. Um, thankfully, I haven't had to deal with Blight Rot yet, although I'm sure that is going to be coming up at some point. Uh, let's start getting some coal here, because we did accidentally use up all of our wood, making some of the Blight uh, purging fire. <laughs> I forgot that I left it on, and so we just burnt up all our wood. Um... Man, we really desperately need the, tr the Beggar Trapper's Camp. That is... This has been very problematic. Alright, well, we cleared into that glade. Let's just start clearing some more of this stuff over here. We're probably going to clear into this glade to the right over here next. I don't... Oh, we do have a... We do have you. I didn't see you. Um, Small Forger's Camp, which is right there. Could actually move up there and get us something, at least. like that maybe and we'll get a little path okay get that up there and we'll get you restocked with some people uh are you close oh you're not actually close enough sorry we'll do that cool and then what do we got back here we got copper and coal so if we want to put another mine over there we have that option so lots of lots of meat available if we could just get the better trappers camp. What do these orders give us again? Nothing that's gonna give us a building, right? Yeah, nothing's gonna give us a building. Still need one more human if we can get that. <laughs> it's been a challenge. Oof. Did we get all our houses? We got our houses, it looks like. That's good. Uh, you are trying to make fabric. We just don't have the stuff for it, but we should be getting... What is this? this? Is this grain or is this fiber? It is grain, but it is also going to give us a little bit of plant fiber. I thought it would, but I just couldn't remember. Yeah. I kind of just... I don't know. I don't know the trade right available. Is this the pie one? Or is the pie one? I don't think we really want to do that. Uh, we will be finishing another trade route, though, here in a moment, right? Of course, we haven't gotten anybody to a higher standing level yet, unfortunately. But we do have another trade route coming up here in 6 minutes and 42 seconds, so that should get us a fourth one there. We just need one more pack of provisions, which I think we're working on, right? Yeah, we got one more coming in. Okay, we do have enough, so we can actually deactivate you for now. I don't think we need anything else right this second. Yeah, low on food. Not surprising. This thing is getting done now. That'll give us some more packs of provisions. This thing already being done. So we've got some food stuff coming from that. Hey, our harpies are actually happy for a little bit. That'll give us a little trickle. So. Some good things coming along. We do need to get some tools made, so well, let's get the tool shop down. Wouldn't be a bad idea to get the temple down at some point, but first up, let's get the tool shop. Still need the artisan at some point for the coats, but I just don't think I've felt like we've had a good time to do that right now. Um, fabric. I mean, everything is coming down to fabric. We just don't have any way to get fabric, apparently. How oh, was that not? Uh, there we go. There is no way to get fabric on this map. Well, unless we could do these, which would get us leather, but we just can't. The next time we get an opportunity to get a building, we're going to have to spend some amber to try and search for the uh, trapper's camp, I think. I don't know what else we can do otherwise. Or hope that it comes up in the market somehow. I, I mean, that's a no guarantee there, of course. We got some food. Got quite a bit of meat. We're still turned off consumption of meat, right? Um, I think we want to turn off the consumption of everything because isn't everything be able to use for pies just about? Mm, no, but what about here for flour? We do roots. To be fair, we got plenty of flour. Honestly, we could probably stop 
Actually, we could, what we could do is we could stop the flower with roots and mushrooms. We'll do flower if we happen to have grain because it can't be used for anything else right now anyway. But everything else we're just going to ignore for now. I'm okay with that. That way we can eat the uh, roots and the mushrooms if needed. And I think I'm okay with that. Insects and berries can be used in the pies, right? So I think all oh, that looks good. What was the other thing? Insects, berries, meat, eggs, and then herbs, which we don't care about. We don't have herbs right now. Well, if our harpies stay happy for just a little bit longer, we're almost going to get another trickle there just automatically. Plenty of packs of provisions right now. We never did that last trade route not count. Oh no, we just haven't. It's not finished yet. Can we? No, we can't. Why are the lizards so unhappy? I actually don't know. I guess it's some of the basic housing they've got. All right, fair enough. Oh, we need to get the religion going for them. I mean, I'll plop it down. I mean, what, what big surprise, what are we missing? The uh, fabric. Wow. That's a big one. Fifteen roots every time you discover new clay. That's kind of interesting. I mean, I kind of feel like we have to go this route. And figure out how to save up some wood. I mean, we don't have, we don't have this at all. So our only option here is the left side. And that's a lot of tools, but not impossible because we do have a way to make tools at least. Do have a lot of meat if we wanted to sell that one. Just in case the thing we've already got is not enough to get the eight. I think I will sell this one. A lot of meat that I prefer not to sell, but I kind of just feel like we've got to make sure that we are getting full credit for all of that. Uh, nothing we could do about the harpies and the lizards right now, I don't think. We just got to get through this. Uh, what can we do that's going to save us some wood? Well, one thing we could have done is built the lumber thing, so we're not doing as many planks. I guess we could turn off planks for now. And I guess we could turn off burning wood for now. We do have oil. Got lots of oil. So we'll turn off burning wood. Okay. And hopefully we can start saving up some wood. Hey, tool shop is done. Um, get you guys working. We don't care about the barrels. We don't care about the pipes. Uh, how did we run out of planks again already? I don't understand. I thought we just had like 12 planks. Where did those 12 planks go? What am I using that's using planks? Um, I mean, we don't have a choice. We've got to make some tools. So I guess we're going to have to use wood for tools and hope that we can still get some wood elsewhere. It's not really an option there. We're so close to the love reputation nine. All right, we're going to dip below here in just a second. Unfortunate. Could we prioritize these and just like, it'll take time for the lizards to degrade anyway, and maybe we can buy some time. Maybe the lizards won't degrade before we've advanced to the next day. Looks like we might be all right. All right, we made it. <laughs> hey, we got a trader. There's some tools. What do you got? We don't we aren't making copper bars. Has a 10% chance of producing double yield when under the effect of education. Smokehouse. I mean, don't need it. 
Fuel consumption is decreased. I mean, that's nice. Uh, I mean, we're just going to grab some tools here. I'll just grab a bunch of planks so that we can uh, make some more tools ourselves because we do have the crystallized dew for it. Honestly, I'm tempted to just grab... Let's grab some fabric, some planks... Only 25. Let's set this to everything and get whatever tools we can get left over. Maybe. 22 tools. Okay. I think that's going to have to be pretty good. Uh, anything else we want to grab? Just kind of fill in some gaps. Can't grab any of that. Grab some sea marrow or just grab some bricks. I mean, you can always use bricks, I suppose. All right, we'll do that. If we had packs of building materials, we could do that one immediately. But what we can do is do this. So we will go ahead and pop a couple people over here. And I guess we'll start working on some packs of building materials as well, uh, which is not great because it's going to use the things that we need for everything else that we need it for. Uh, for now, stop doing wood, do planks. That's the reason we went ahead and did that. So we can get some more tools that way. Um, okay. And then packs of building materials comes out of you. What are you here? Yes. Is that the best place? We have a rain mill. Okay. So packs of building materials come out of here. <sighs> it's not great. I mean, I would say everything but fabric. Use the other two. And let's go ahead and get that going. I guess we're going to prioritize that. We need 20. I mean, I'm going to tell them to do 20, but I have a feeling that. That's not going to be easy to do. Um, we do have some fabric now. So if we wanted to go ahead and make the artisan so we can get some raincoats, that is an option. Never got the planks here. Honestly, while we've got fabrics, we should probably get the lumber mill down just because it's going to let us get better plank production. Hey, tune in six every time woodcutters cut down a tree during the storm. Okay, that's pretty good. You want to take your first... Uh, you must, if you want to take your first, must give. Plus one to wood production. Lose all stored fuel upon... Pick, all stored fuel. That one's tempting because we do need to ramp up some food, right, uh, some wood right now. But we have a lot of fuel right now. Shoo. You don't think that is... I mean, we're going to get more coal. We get, Yeah. I don't think we can take that one. I think we'll take the insects. And, yeah. Do those trade routes never count? Or they just still haven't finished? They've literally got two seconds left. There we go. Got one done. All right. No trappers. Man. I mean, I think we have to reroll. We've got to hope. Oh. There we go. Goodness gracious. That was tough. So now, finally, we can actually get some of this good stuff over here. And uh, definitely fill you guys up as quickly as possible. And we're almost to the point where we'd have to get another one of those going, but this is fine. Just go grab whatever you can, my friends. Uh, we do have a few, a little bit of amber here if we wanted to try and get a couple more tools, but honestly, I don't... If we grabbed anything, it would be some more bricks, I think. Because that'll help us get the packs of building materials. So, whatever that will do. Yeah, it's not much, but a little bit more bricks. Okay. I'm happy with that. Hey, we got one standing level. That's good. I don't know if this one will get us over on another one, but it'd be nice. Some sea marrow here. We still we need packs of provisions if we did that, but... Honestly, that might not be bad. And this is Smoldering City, which that's the one that's already up to one. So never mind. Oh, unless it needs to be to two. Is, did I misunderstand how that one worked? Restanding level one with two settlements. So no, that would not help us. We need to standing level one with two different settlements. So like Drizzle Brook would be good. Or Trader's Rest, because we've already got some going for that, I think. If I'm understanding. And we're 8 of 10 there, 0 of 10, 8 of 10. So any, either one of these would be good. I mean, some scrolls. Hmm. 
I don't think we need the ancient tablet anymore, right? So if we did this and grab some scrolls. Let's do that. And then we can come up here and say for Drizzlebrook, let's, I don't know, sell a little bit. I think we just need 10 more amber traded, but I don't really need these scrolls for anything else right now. So let's just do that. And yeah, let's go for that. Okay. That'll get us, that should get us to two to level standing two, which is good. Still need to get the clothing fulfilled. All right, we got you. Um, let's go ahead and populate you with some people. Uh, we're not going to do scrolls. We're not going to trade goods. We are going to do planks, please, and thank you. Uh, it's fine. We're going to use a little bit of wood, but at least it's efficient wood. And you already were already turned off on planks, right? Where are you? Down here? Yeah, you're just doing bricks right now, which is fine. All right, so we got that. And I think the other thing we wanted to do was um, the artisan. More people. We need one more human. So I think we're going to take one of these two for sure. Um, it's a lot more people over here. Don't know that we need that many. I think we just need the one more human. So I think we'll take the lesser side. At least the herbs and le leather will get us cloth and herbs will get us pies. So I think this is actually okay. And we do need a house. So how many human houses did we end up with? Only three. So let's get us another human house. That should relieve some pressure for the lizards. And I think that'll be fine. How many lizard houses do we have too? I mean, technically we probably should get a couple more lizard houses just to try to make them a little bit happier. Especially since the resolve is low right now. Uh, okay, we got everything we needed, so we can we can unfavor you. We do have one more building we can get, but we got the building we needed. We got the building we desperately needed. So I'm happy with that. All right, human clothing fulfilled. Are we actually going to get it? I would be surprised if we get this. Because, because this has to last until the human thing is done, which is kind of annoying, actually. We should, we should, it should just check this off and give us credit right now, but it's not quite how it works. Um, you are doing building supplies, building materials, so that's good. Do I have another trade route? Oh, it's the sea marrow, which, I mean, more amber is more amber, but no, I think we need to hold on to our packs of provisions right now. We actually need to make some more packs of provisions. So I'm just going to put some more people back in here. Because we need to get that up to 20. And you can use... Since we're since we're actually able to... You know, do things again. Let's just use anything and everything you can. Uh, clothier person making raincoats. That's fine. Yeah, that's good. Where are you harpies? Let's get some raincoats coming out. I hope that'll get us what we need. Six seconds, five seconds, come on. Two seconds, one second. Now right, we got it. It'll give us three humans. Oh, no, sorry. It gives us three resolve with humans, right? Is that what that is? Oh, no, it is three humans. Okay, I mis misremembered. Uh, it does give us better fabric production, finally. <laughs> kind of needed this a long time ago, but never got it. So, glad we got it now. We're only just two away, basically. Honestly, it almost doesn't really matter what we grab here. Uh, in fact, I'm just going to hold off. I don't think we desperately need it right now. Did we ever get the... We did get the temple. Let's get you... Get some lizards put in there. Where can we grab some lizards, lizards from? The abandoned cache. Uh, the stone cutter for sure. And then... What are you? Brick oven? No. Woodcutter's camp? Definitely. I didn't realize we didn't have our woodcutter's camp completely stocked up. Um... And make sure you're maxed out because that'll get some wood. Where's the other woodcutter's camp? Right there somewhere? My brain cannot see it. Is it there? There it is there. And let's move you um, to a place where you can actually get some more wood. More stuff. I don't think we need to um, cut into the glade. I think we just need to get some wood where we can. 
We'll just, just get wood nearby. All right, we just need the building materials now. We got the, got the, uh, tools. All right, we got the standing level. Perfect. We really are just one away. One in a trickle. But the, hopefully the Harpies gets us that trickle here in just a moment. <laughs> Uh, looks like the building material is going to come up soon first, right? Surely. Yeah, we just need to prioritize that. It is going strong. Um, we can turn on fabric now because we are this close. Yeah, we just need six more. Come on. Let's go. Day six on a tough mission. Okay, I'm pretty happy with that, actually. You are trying to do bricks, but you don't have anything. That's okay. Just chill. Uh, where's our stone cutter? Stone cutter's still trying to get stone, so you're gonna you're gonna have some bricks here soon. Got trade routes, but we don't need. Honestly, right now we're just waiting on this right here, and we got six more coming right now. So yeah, as soon as those get delivered to the um to the uh, warehouse, we are done with this mission. One more, one more, one more. There we go. All right, pretty happy that we got that one done. Not not the easiest mission in the world, but definitely veteran or... I mean, that's, you know, nice to boost up the difficulty a little bit and see where that gets us. Got 20 amber for that. Cool. And now we should have enough for this thing, right? Yeah, we do have enough for the... Uh, the, the come back over here and we could also go out and do this other quest, it looks like. But, no, I think we come back and grab uh, this uh, lead seal here. We got the 12 fragments and everything. But I think that will be next time. All of your starting caravans gain 20 amber for the duration of this cycle. Oh, wow. Well, that's pretty nice just to start out with 20 amber. I mean, <laughs> I don't know how many more cycles we got left. Uh, we do have a little bit more time. We probably have enough time for two more villages, actually. But for right now, we definitely want to come back and grab this. I mean, that's, that's I think, a given. Um... But what we do past that, I honestly don't know. Let's go look at the smoldering city for a second. Let's finish the deed. Pipe ending. Even the most rudimentary can Oh, it's just a comfort thing, Majigger. Okay. And then upgrades. Kind of okay with just doing one of these here. I almost do two of them, but not quite. Um, getting a permanent discount on perks and blueprints sold by traders. 3% bonus to trader arrival speed. I don't think that's as good. I mean, it's good, but it's not as good. 2% boost to global production speed. I like that. We can upgrade hearts to the district level, which would probably be pretty good. And then finally, permanent increase to walking speed. And one more embarkation point. I'm going to go for the uh, hearth upgrade at this point, I think. I'd like to see what that can do for us. And I guess, I guess now that we've done this, uh, I guess now that we've done this, we're going to go and, um, we're going to keep it on veteran. I mean, I don't think there's any reason to stay off veteran if we've, we've won one on veteran, right? So, yeah, just kind of by happenstance <laughs> bumped up the difficulty a bit. Um, I'm not sure if I'm quite ready for Viceroy yet, but we'll get there someday. And I'm actually not going to go ahead and do the start the next one yet. Um, I don't want to get right into it right now we'll, we'll start the next one next episode but um i'm still having fun i do know that as of right now as of the time that i'm recording this they are working on a new dlc for the game as well as like a i guess a free update patch that's supposed to be pretty big it's supposed to introduce like fishing or something like that which sounds pretty cool so uh i definitely want to finish this at least so i think we'll at least do one more village to finish this this lead seal uh and maybe even just do one more after that just to finish the cycle i don't know it really depends on how much how long it takes to do this one but we might put a pause in the game until that new DLC comes out. Um, if it's not already out by the time I finish this. Just just because it'd be kind of cool to uh, play with some of those new features that they've already announced. So we'll see where it goes. But I do appreciate you guys watching. May God bless you. And hope you join me again next time. Thank you and goodbye. I wanted to give a special shout out to the following channel members. Thank you so much for supporting the channel.